uh, way back 2008, I came in Singapore. I'll be leaving my family for the meantime to find for a greener pasture. So I could bring back the business, properties, car, and money I had lost, or even just the half of it. I came in Singapore without any idea what Singapore is, what job I could go into, and what luck awaits me here. Not knowing I will just be working here as a domestic helper, so it's not really a green pasture at all. I had no other choice then but to die with it, rather than to go home in the Philippines with an empty hands. On September 2006, I came to Singapore to work as a domestic helper, hoping to send my two sons to university and save some capital to start a business at home. Unfortunately, my salary as domestic is barely enough to finance my son's education and daily expenses. Nothing is safe for my dream business. On April 2005, I came in Singapore to work as a domestic helper to help my husband for family expenses. And the time my eldest daughter wanted to study university. I didn't fulfill her wish because my, my first employer was so new and he paid my salary by installment. It was a creed written into the founding documents that declared the destiny of a nation. Yes, we can. It was whispered by slaves and abolitionists as they blazed the trail toward freedom. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. It was sung. It was sung by immigrants as they swung out to the distant shore of the flying islands, pushed westward against an unforgiving wilderness. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. It was the call of workers organized. Women who reached for the, the ballots. A president who chose the moon as our new frontier. And a king who took us to the mountaintop. And he pointed, pointed the way to the promised land. Yes, we can. And we can. Yes, 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 we can. By God's grace, I was able to start a small progression shop managed by a friend. After that, the daily expenses was taken care of from the earnings of the probation shop. Thus, I sent lesser remittance back home. In six months' time, I was managed to pay my loan from ASCII Philippines and took a bigger loan to expand my business. Above all, ASCII Global helped us to realize our financial goals in life and equip us with knowledge to attain that goal. To my fellow domestic workers, dare to dream. Never think that we are very small. If we are sincere and honest in our work, we will be able to build a castle, Mabuhay. Now, uh, I would like to thank uh, ASCII for transforming my life from a great spender to a great saver. Now, I'm ready to put up a new business again under my family's management. A new hope and a new dream. Thank you very much to ASCII Global and Metrobank that they sponsored us to study financial education. And I learned a lot, especially savings. As my first loan has been paid in just five months, I decided to open an account and put in my 100% of my salary. In the future, I want to save more for my dream bakery shop. It was a creed written into the founding documents that declared the destiny of the nation. Yes, we can. It was whispered by slaves and abolitionists as they blazed the trail toward freedom. 
Yes, we can. Yes, we can. It was so. It was so.